guys have really been liking the vlogs and that just makes me so happy so let me turn off this music hold on up i am full of energy today i actually woke up early my husband's back at work so we're like well i'm like trying to do better at waking up early i had a really long night last night you guys i had some complications with a video oh my god oh my god let me share with you guys because so update let me give you guys a little update because you guys think that my hair always looks good all the time and it does not okay i'm gonna show you guys a prime example but before that you know it's like a weekly thing i gotta show you guys my nails so i ended up doing my nails i originally was going for marble nails but we okay so i was going for marble nails i'll show you guys later because it's not really working but I did my nails for this week. My nails, a different color nails, the usual. Every week, I'm going to check in with you guys and let you guys know what's on my nails. I also did a nail page. Woo! It's called Chelly's Nails. So I'm going to be doing just nails of the week, routines, how I keep my nails, like how I do my zip powder, my tips, everything. I'm just going to keep you guys in the loop of what I'm using, what's on my nails. Kind of like my hair page, but for nails. And it's going to be fun because I want to work on some designs and you guys can like follow me along the nail journey and see like what ends up happening with my nail journey and how good i can actually get at doing nails because it's fun so hair horrible girl your girl went through a struggle last night i that video i finished at four in the morning and i was still able to wake up early today my mom no who called me today my husband he called me. He was like, girl, get your booty up. So I woke up early. My hair is flaked city. When I tell you it's snowing in my house, like I'm legit. It's legitimately snowing in my house. I was a smarty pants and I decided to mix two products, which work fine, right? I use the Pattern Beauty Leave-In Conditioner, which I actually really like, by the way. And then I also use the Manuka Honey um, from Urban hydration i'll show you guys in a little bit but after i diffused my hair and styled my hair like it was too light for my hair right so my hair was really big and voluminous and i wanted it to be more defined so my smart self ended up just basically redoing my hair with just gel on dry hair that is probably one of the worst things you can do and i don't know why i did it i just wanted like a quick fix i wanted my curls to look good for the video and honey Honey, the more I fluff, the more I separate it. Look, and this is nothing compared to how it... Milo, you need to relax. We have Milo here wanting attention. He's like biting my hand. No. Milo, te voy a mojar con agua. I'm gonna wet you. You wanna get wet? So stop biting my shirt. I don't want you to bite. I don't wanna play right now. Thank you. I don't wanna play right now. Look at him. <laughs> I don't want to play right now. So yes, my hair is Flake City and I also fixed it a little bit, but girl, we're just going to have to start all over. Like, can you see the flakes? Oh my God. This has never happened to me. Like literally for all the products that I mix together, they never ever flake on me. And this is not that I mix like bad products together. It's just that I put... Like, I finished the entire bottle of gel just on my hair while it was dry and I put a lot of it. For some reason, I didn't think it was going to flake. I don't know why. So we definitely need to assess the situation today because, girl, I'm going to have to, like, basically re-wet my hair. No, not re-wet it. I'm going to have to re-wash it. I did wash it yesterday with shampoo and conditioner and now I have to do it again. I'll probably just do, like, an apple cider vinegar rinse. This room is a mess, the usual. I feel like every week you guys come in here, I just... I show you how messy it is and then we clean it up together like I'm typically good at cleaning my room like before in a bed but last night was a struggle I was stressed out oh my god I was so stressed out last night because I wanted to get like the video done since you want camera time yesterday oh my god this little guy <laughs> stop He's trying to hump me. Get out of here, boy. Anyways, last night I was so stressed out, so I didn't end up cleaning my room. And I filmed the makeup video, too. So this room is a literal... Stop. So this room is literally a disaster, and I'm going to show you guys right now. 
Starting off with this lovely section over here. I try to refresh my hair and like get rid of the flakes using this cream of nature detangling conditioning, leave-in conditioner. It helped a little bit, but I mean at this point my hair just had to get cleaned completely. Look at this. Look at this mess. Look at this desk, honey. Like, I can't even see the desk anymore. <gasps> I forgot. Look what came in the mail. Oh, oh, my God. I'm so excited. Let me, first of all, I'm about to swap that out. This is my old ring light that I showed you guys. This is what I use. But a couple people convinced me to just get the Diva ring light. So I ended up getting it. Let's put it together and let's put it to the test. Oh, here it is. Wait, before I do put it to the test. Let me show you guys. I love Pattern Beauty. Actually, like the leave-in conditioner is pretty good. So I use the leave-in conditioner, right? And then I use this gel. This gel is not meant to be used on dry hair, so I do not recommend. Like, it's great for applying it on soaking wet hair, but do not put this on wet hair. I mean, on dry hair, because your hair, honey, your hair will flake, okay? Don't do it. So I just made the coolest discovery. I mean, I didn't really make the discovery, but um, the Diva ring light came with an attachment that I can actually put on my existing tripod. That way, it eliminates having an additional tripod, which means more walking space. So how cool is this? It comes with this tripod little stand that you can put on here, or it also comes with this attachment that you can put on an extra tripod like this if I want to do it for like travel or whatever, or this option, which is the one that I think is the best. This also moves up and down depending on how you want it, and then the ring light kind of will just go on top of your camera tripod so it has like a whole setting here where you put it on your camera tripod and then you just mount your camera on here so this is so cool because I don't have to have two tripods one for my ring light one for my camera I can just have three tripods well I have four still because the TV is on a tripod and then the two lights are on a tripod and now the camera and the ring light is in one ah <sighs> genius Genius! Anything to just clear up this space a little bit more and so this is just gonna be like my extra ring light So whenever I need to film anywhere else that's not in this room I won't have to like take this apart because it took a little bit to just put together So I won't have to take that apart I'll just use this and if I'm doing like an Instagram video or anything like that like live I can just mount this on anywhere so I'll be keeping that still. All right, room update. I'm just gonna go ahead and now clean up the room because it looks really bad. I need to take Milo out for a walk. I got my gallon of water. I am doing this 30 day no coffee, no tea, no nothing, just water and apple cider vinegar. Maybe I'll do tea because sometimes when I don't eat that well, like my stomach feels kind of funny. So tea always just like soothes that. I am going back to drinking my gallon of water a day. I challenge you guys to join me in this 30 day drinking a whole gallon of water a day no soda no juice no coffee nothing else just water maybe some tea thing that has like additional sugar in it so so if you guys want to do it with me I'm starting today today is May 20th I believe if I'm not mistaken May 20th so from May 20th all the way to June 20th you guys will probably be seeing this obviously next week not today but whatever day you guys start let me know in the comments down below so we can do this together a gallon a day I need to reduce my bloating this double chin like I need to get my life together so I need to cut out cut down on sugar and salt and drink way more water so it'll be much more funner if you guys join me so look at this little guy <laughs> hi boobush <laughs> Hello, baby. How you doing? How you doing? You want to go outside? You want to go outside? We're going to go outside. Let me clean up this room and then we go outside together, okay? Okay? A million people in the crowd, but I only see your face in all the lights. 
And as the bass keep pounding on me, baby, I really want to make you mine. washed my hair finally because my hair was super literally flake city it was horrible I did like a quick apple cider vinegar rinse and then I used my favorite of course curl smith curl quenching co-wash which is this little guy right here there we go I have the big one because I really love this stuff and that is what my hair is looking like right now I know like in the vlog I typically didn't want it to be hair centered but it just so happens for me that I'm going to be doing my hair two things I wanted to mention one of them is I heard you guys I read the comments and a couple of you got not many people but a couple of you guys were saying that the lens makes like an annoying noise and I know every time I'm using the 24 millimeter lens when I don't have it on manual focus mode every time it's just any movement I make like it's trying to adjust and keep it in center and it makes like that really annoying adjusting sound so right now when I'm doing like a sit down video like this and I'm not really like showing you guys products I'll just keep it at manual mode so that it doesn't make that annoying nose noise because I know that is very annoying but these are the kit lens that I typically use while I'm vlogging but if I'm doing like a sit down video unboxing or whatever I like to just change the lenses just so that it's better quality for the most part when I'm walking around these are the lenses you see like I'm bringing it close and it's not adjusting that's because I have it in manual focus Focus. so yeah these are the ones that I typically use but again for sit down videos I'm gonna be doing my hair I'm gonna just start putting it in manual mode so that you guys don't get annoyed with me with all like the adjusting sound it doesn't bother me because I know what it is but for some people maybe you guys watching it it annoys you so I totally understand the only time you guys are probably gonna hear that is when I'm bringing up a product because I'm gonna just switch it back to autofocus mode so that you guys can read what product I'm using or anything of that nature. Okay, so really quickly, I wanted to show you guys a couple different things. Well, actually, let's put some product in my hair first. So I have here, I did pick up Emerge line because I had a great deep conditioning day. So I think that's what I'm leaning towards getting. I just got everything in the mail. I'm very, very, very excited because I'm gonna put that in my hair right now. I'm debating because I do wanna do like a whole dedicated video on it, or maybe I don't. I really don't know what I wanna do, but I'm gonna use today as like a test day and try out the leave-in conditioner and the defining cream they so I picked up let me just show you guys what I picked up I'm gonna switch it to auto mode so you guys are probably gonna hear sorry guys if you hear like the adjusting sound but I picked up the shampoo and the conditioner from the line I love that it comes in really big packaging I think that's just genius and it's amazing I think everything was six or seven dollars from the entire collection which is also a plus for all of the products you get they're all Sophie paraben phthalates and silicone free which is great so I picked up the it's not happening Sophie free shampoo and this is what it looks like I love the packaging it's so stinking cute I love it it's beautiful and then I also picked up the smooth mover conditioner which also has that really cute packaging so stinking cute so I picked up that and then I picked up the styling products so they have a leave-in conditioner this is my main BFF leave-in conditioner so cute because they spelled main m-a-n-e super cute so I'm gonna be using that today I definitely am gonna be testing that out I don't think I'm gonna record the application process for today because I don't want to do this like a whole hair video however if I end up liking them I will do like a whole video on the emerge product so this is the emerge the works better buttercream this is the curl definition and softness so I think I'm gonna use this in my hair today as well I don't know they have three styling product options and I typically like to do three products but 
I'm not using my Demon brush today. I'm going for that elongated look. So I don't know if I want to layer three products. I don't know. I guess we'll see. And then last but not least, this is the Style Goals Gel. And this is to define and control your curls. So cute. I really do love the packaging. It's really unique, really different from what's on the market. So I really do like that. And I just love how big they are. Like, So I'm going to go ahead and style my hair really quickly. I'll come back to show you guys the wet result. Like I said, I'm not using my Demon brush today because I want to keep it like I want to keep my curls pretty long I'm just gonna use my fingers but I'm not gonna show you guys that because if I do a dedicated video it's gonna be the same thing so hopefully I like them hopefully it works out they do have a similar smell to the deep conditioner so I'm just like mm -hmm, not my favorite but it didn't bother me because the results were pretty good I'm gonna go ahead style my hair we're gonna go for to the supermarket I'll probably bring you guys along with me I'm just gonna go pick up some salad stuff because we're gonna have a nice big old salad for dinner and then I still have to post my video for today so let's get let's get moving okay so a little hair update for you guys this is what my hair looks like by the way I just got this tripod in the mail and I'm testing it out with you guys this is the ready cam tabletop tripod so I literally can you guys see it yeah, now you can. Okay, so I just put you guys on the little tripod and I'm testing it out because you guys already know I have the 24 millimeter lens, which requires you to be much closer to your subject. Typically, I film with the 35 and the 50 millimeter, which needs to be much further away so that you guys can actually get to see me. But I got a little tabletop one because if I want to do vlogs or whatever, or like a quick beauty video, I can still do it using this lens. So I'm very excited about that. I wanted to see if the ring light that I got also made a difference so I have it connected to the smart light like this is what the app looks like by the way the ring oh it's a little too bright it's not gonna show but pretty much you basically just connect it to like a smart plug and you're able to connect it and navigate it through your phone so I just turned on this oh my god it literally makes such a difference this one ring light I don't have my two side lights which is what I typically film with but this ring light, I feel like there is a difference. Like everything just looks even and I feel like it looks a little bit more brighter, which is really, really good. Yeah, now you guys can see the curls better. It's looking good. So I'm going to the grocery store so we can go make some dinner. And then I still got to edit my video for today. It's probably going to go up tomorrow at this point. It's going to be a Saturday upload. We made it to the grocery store. I'm using my phone because I left my camera. You ready to buy the whole supermarket? I don't want a salad. <laughs> ah. Babe, I'm still recording. Why? Because I'm recording and going up. I literally just threw anything on. And it's chilly, so I just put like my, my hoodie on. And it, ooh, I almost sleep. Babe, I almost leave. I finally took you guys out the house. I feel like all of my past vlogs have been just me in the house. I mean, it's nothing else. It's nothing else to do. We got our organic spring mix right here. And some croutons for the salad. I want to get some beets and corn. And we need a new salad dressing because we don't have it that much oh wait do we have you want to do cherry tomatoes look at all of the things you can add to the salad i have almonds at home i'm definitely gonna add some oh my god yes i definitely want some cranberries wait why are we so zoomed in there we go i definitely want some cranberries for sure to sweeten it look babe cranberries for the salad so good what else look at these these are blueberry nah i don't want blueberry and cranberries this is almond and pepita. Babe, you're doing great. Oh, well, look at these. These are Italian seasoned croutons. Should we get both? What are these here in the bottom? I love croutons. Cheese and garlic. Oh my goodness. They all sound delicious. Oh, look, two for. Oh, look, they're two for five. Salad for dinner. And the two leftover popsicles because I devoured them. Let's see yours. Wow. Okay, so it's actually been a couple hours later. I am back home now drinking my 
tall glass of water. So it's about midnight right now and I didn't do that well with water today. I drank up to here. So I didn't reach my goal. My goal was to finish the entire gallon. I will try my best to drink a gallon tomorrow. But um, I didn't drink enough water today, which sucks. For those of you who think I don't have bad wash and goes, for those of you who think that all products work for me, honey, like this is not it. This is not it. My hair is still kind of wet at the roots, but baby girl, mm-mm, mm-mm. I was kind of light with the products. I didn't want to go too crazy because my previous wash and go, the one that I flaked, I went too heavy handed with the product, so I wanted to go on with a lighter hand. But this is a super soft wash and go. Like if you want to see your true curl pattern and what your hair would look like, if you basically are doing a no wash and go wash and go, this is the vibe that I'm getting. The gel has absolutely no hold whatsoever. I'm going to pull it up. I already found the space for it in the product shelf. I, put it right I found the space for it in the product shelf. So let's just see what it says. It's from Moisture Rich first free curl definition it says the only thing you want to define about you is your curls with the emerge collection you can be frizz free and free to be you naturally emerge as you ever evolving proud and beautiful every day there's no hard crunch on your style ever so get healthy definition slick hold and movement with this alcohol free formula that shows up ready anytime frizz residue or moisture loss not today not today so I don't like I don't don't I don't know what to say so yes this is the result for this like it's not bad it would be cute if I were to do like my half up half down and just like have the back wild so I can make this work if I need to go out but is it something that I would grab every day probably not again this is just my first time I could have been a little too light handy with it so I'm gonna go ahead and try it again and see if I can make it work I'm like able to make this work this product line work I will do like a video for you guys but I'm gonna go ahead and test it out for sure tonight I'm probably just gonna sleep with my hair in just like a high loose bun but I'm not even gonna bother preserving it because I'm probably gonna redo it I'm literally not even gonna bother to preserve my curls because there's no point like I'm gonna redo it again probably tomorrow just gonna sleep with it in a high bun so I spent hours well I spent a couple minutes just like cleaning this room earlier today and I got a whole bunch of makeup I didn't show you guys but I got a whole bunch of mail something very exciting which I am beyond excited about if you guys know me you know that this package just made my day so if you guys know me you know that I love 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 my diamond brush and they sent me a couple of their new brushes so girl when i got this package in the mail i literally almost died they sent me five new brushes no so they sent me four and the one that i'm most excited about is this denman d38 the power paddle brush so it's literally a denman brush but in like a paddle brush form oh my god you guys know i am definitely doing like a whole dedicated video on this brush because i absolutely love my denman brush and this is huge like this is a powder brush i want to see if it's going to give me really nice ringlets i want to see what kind of curl pattern it's going to give me so i got that and then they also just sent over some of their really fun denman brushes like colors look how pretty these are these are the seven roll denman brushes right here and it's so pretty this one's like in a neon yellow and then this one is white which is so cute oh my goodness and then they sent me the little itsy bitsy baby one this is a mini denman brush which i think is so cute for like if you have kids or anything to do it on their hair so that it's not like so big if they have less hair it's so cute it has five rows i think you oh my god i should also film a video on this it's a tiny 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 brush so i feel like you can do like really tight ringlets on it oh my goodness i think i'm gonna play around with this too so i'm so excited so i'm definitely doing a video on that so <laughs> stay tuned for that all right guys i'm gonna go ahead clean up oh wait 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 one more thing okay wait one more thing i got something super duper exciting in the mail today and this is michael todd's relationship goals book oh my goodness so i watched the entire series about two years ago if you don't know what i'm talking about transformation church the pastor is mike the lead pastor is mike todd and 
I watch all of his sermons. They're so, so, so good. So, so, so good. And so specifically, he did one called Relationship Goal Series and it has eight parts to it. Highly recommend for you to check it out. It will definitely strengthen your like mindset when it comes to just like thriving in singleness or in relationship or marriage. Like he hits all the spots and it's incredible so i got the book and i'm so excited to like read it and see how it would minister to me now that i'm in a different season in my life so i'm just looking forward to that and i highly recommend for you guys to check out the series i will link it in my description box just so you guys can access it easier but i promise you at least one out of those eight sermons will definitely speak to you it's just so 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 good so i'm excited to read this book i cannot wait i haven't read a book in a while so it's gonna be really really fun okay so now I'm done. I'm going to go ahead and just finish cleaning up my table. It's not that bad. I just have to put like some things away and do like a couple Instagram stories on like the new items that I got. And then I'll be good to go. I'm going to check out and I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow. See you guys. Mignana.